I just jump on and show you my mess? Um, I've got lots of um, products out, lots of the Authentico products, and I'm having a lot of fun with them, making little Christmas, rusty Christmas baubles. So I'm using the uh, Authentico rust powders, rust in a jar. There goes a bauble. <laughs> and also I'm adding in a few of the uh, aged copper powders as well, which are really fun to use. So basically, I've just got your cheap baubles from Kmart. You can use any, any ones you like. And I've got the vintage dark rust. And you just paint your bauble in your dark rust. You can either use dark rust or I've also used winter night. So winter night's another um, good base for a rusty, rusty look as well. But either one. Now you can paint it and let it dry and then do another coat. I found that one coat, one sort of fairly thick coat like this works well and then you can stipple and play with it while it's wet. All right, so there we go, that's our dark rust. So you just pop that on. Then I started with my rust powders and you just sprinkle them on. Good. So you can see how it's So if you use different the, the different colours, there's um, you know a dark, a dark rust colour, a golden, and a red. So I've got a mixture of them all here. You just sprinkle them on, which will give you a rusty effect. See how I'm just sprinkling it on in different sections. So you just layer it. Then you can use your brush and stipple it, or I just use my finger and just stipple it on. Sort of blends it in. Then I've got some gold metallic paint, and I've also got the aged copper that I've been using as well. So I've just been spr sprinkling a little bit of that on to give it a patina look. There's no rules, it's really just playing and seeing what you like. I'll give you a close-up view in a minute. Just layering. So I've just layered it with the different rust powders and copper powders. Then just with a brush, I've been getting a little bit of the gold metallics. And I just stipple. When you're stippling it, it sort of blends all the other powders and colors together as well. So again, you just do as much stippling, as much gold, as you like until you've got it how you like it and each little bauble is unique because it's just however you fancy doing it so you can go back and forth with more here it is then you just finish it off you can either lacquer it um, to hold it all together or a really great tip that Jane gave me was to just use hairspray really